So eBay product research, a lot of things has been changed in 2023. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to do eBay product research properly. Regardless of your business model, you're doing dropshipping, wholesale, retail arbitrage. I'm going to show you many different ways to do eBay product research. I'm going to be using Zeek Analytics. Zeek Analytics is the best product research tool when it comes to doing a product research for eBay. They have $1 trial and you can use Zeek Analytics simply signing up for one dollar trial and see how it goes for you and i know that you definitely gonna love it so check the link for that inside the description let me get started with the product research using zeek analytics so when i simply sign into zeek analytics zeek analytics have like completely redesigned their software right here and a lot of these features inside the zeek analytics are simply automated right now so there isn't a lot of manual things that i have to do now which i used to do before so for example on the side right here you can see now they have a product calendar where you can just simply see uh what kind of events that you need to be aware of so now going into december so for example this on the on on, on the tuesday which will be the last week of november there is a cyber monday then there is a black friday then there is a halloween all that kind of stuff it will tell you all the events that you will have have to be aware of if you're doing drop shipping you know they are really really important uh for you to actually sell the item at that specific time because the demand for those items for example like when it's a uh, valentine day or there is a halloween you sell the products which are like a scary or pumpkin type looking products the demand for those types of product will be really really high so this is a, a great way to be aware of all the events which are up and coming the next thing that they have on the side before we have to struggle a lot in order for us to find what will be the good niche for us so this is the trending niche all the keywords that you can see right here they will give you how much revenue they are generating so for example waterproof outdoor uh, string lights is 42,000 LED outdoor string lights is 53,000 all that kind of stuff as well so what you can do you can just simply click on this one for example if I click on wallet for man then it will will just simply give me more analytics which I will go down the video but right now let me show you all the updates they have made inside their system so right on the dashboard right here you can see this is where your product research will be very very simplified so all I have to do just simply click on this uh, tool sign right here as soon as I click on tool sign I can uh, select I am selling on amazon.co.uk or if you're selling on amazon.com or any other platform you can select that one and then my business model is either you can do drop shipping uh, retail arbitrage wholesale reseller brand owner so only difference is once let's say i want to do drop shipping then it will show me the drop shipping supplier which zeke analytics support if i'm doing let's say a brand owner then it will compare all the prices with the aliexpress because this is i will be buying in bulk so if i give you one example right here let's say i choose drop shipping and then i choose my supplier as amazon.co.uk then all the products that you can see right here inside the Zeek Analytics, these are all the products which have a lower price on Amazon and these are the products which have a higher price on eBay. So this green sign right here on the Amazon top of it, it shows that Zeek Analytics have verified that the product which they show this one right here have a lower price on Amazon and have a higher price on eBay. So this is a really, really great way to just within one click, you can find many different items right here. I can can do the same thing if i choose to work with the let's say uh, aliexpress a lot of people think about okay well aliexpress gonna take very long time if my customers are in uk but this can be your product test phase so you can order one product and see how it is going before you contact uh, the supplier on aliexpress you can ask them what price you will be able to offer if i will buy let's say 10 of these cups right here or if i buy let's say uh like these watches right here so so these are all the products which have a lower price on aliexpress and higher price on ebay.co.uk because i have selected ebay.co.uk so within one click i can just do a lot of stuff right here the other thing which like on the dashboard now a lot of trending drop shippers right here you can see these trending drop shippers from a different country on the left hand side they are the one they are being featured
featured based on their revenue so what i can simply do they have done all the hard work for me already so if i see a drop shipper based in uh, let's say uh, in a country where i want to start drop shipping from i can just simply click on scan seller and then it will open another tab where it will show me all the products which they are selling so for example uh, they are like they are on the rise they are new seller they are not established seller they are new seller but they are getting a lot of attention they are getting a lot of sales so once i come to their store i can just simply filter this one with the number of items which they have sold so you can see this one right here then whatever the products which they are selling i can copy their products as well because these are already proven that they are getting a lot of sales from these types of item so if i go through if i walk you through with the uh, like a, a real case scenario or if you need to do a product research for you so what you simply do once you need to get started you take inspiration from here you can pick your niche depending on how much revenue it is getting and also you can simply pick the suppliers from here uh, you can do the settings which you like so for example if i need to start a, a brand owner if i need to order something on aliexpress then all of these products right here are the suggestions for me to look into they will calculate uh, the price they will calculate the profit all that kind of stuff as well so let's say i want to look for wallet for the man because this is a really really good category i will just simply click on that so once i'm looking further into some sort of uh, uh, a product but i will look first of all sell through rates so the sell through rate is really really good for this one and then you want to look at how many successful listings are there you can see this one is uh, about 50 percent and then it is taking only 100 listing into consideration and then within past 30 days 1771 items has been sold and total earning was 10,466. This one is, is the chart right here and it will give you a really good idea if this product is a seasonal dependent. Obviously, wallet is something that sells throughout the year so you don't really have to worry about it. Once I see this one right here, what i normally do i first of all i filter this one based on a feedback like how much feedback uh, a seller have so if there is a new seller they have only less feedback and they are getting some sort of sales which means the wallet which they are selling might be something that i can personally look into so for example this wallet right here you can see this seller only got 135 feedback and this wallet right here i can open the the listing for this one as well is getting really good amount of sale and if i need to look for the supplier for this one i can just simply click on this sign right here and then it will find me all the similar uh products i can look on amazon i can look on aliexpress i can look on walmart i can look on cj drop shipping and i can look on alibaba as well so this will find me the supplier for this one so i can see this seller right here they only got 135 feedback which is a very new seller and then they have sold 54 of this wallet for $17.99. So I, I think they must be making really, really good profit. The price for this one is not really cheap. But if I go and look for similar types of wallet right here, uh, I can I can find uh, a different suppliers uh, with the uh, on uh, on on Alibaba. I can find a different suppliers on uh, AliExpress. So uh, what I will do, I will just simply copy the title right here, and then I can go to alibaba right here and i can just simply put that one and then i can just simply find the the similar uh item so if i click here so we can see these are the the types of wallet like for example this one is it doesn't have to be exactly the same one but something which sort of like you know uh resonate with whatever the other seller is selling and it is working for them so these are just like maximum uh four four to five dollars all of them are leather wallet but this seller right here you can see this one is selling this item for $17.99 and they only got 135 feedback right here so I can look more so for example this this seller right here they are selling this uh, 
a card holder so for example this one they are selling it for 12.99 and 38 of them has been sold already and they have a feedback of 350 so they are uh, a pretty new seller as well so what i can do i can just simply look further uh, by using a zeke analytics you can see it have found me many suppliers so for example this supplier right here they are selling this one uh, uh, for three pound uh, three dollar and fifty so you will be making seven dollar profit a lot of different suppliers were the same wallet right here then i can pick up my product from them and i can just simply list my product right here there are tons of other tools uh, i have recorded a separate video explaining how the title optimization and all other stuff works using a zeke analytics as well so make sure you check that video right here and i will see you in this video